Domino's shares in the red today with the stock seeing its worst day in more than a decade. The pizza chain reported mixed earnings results and same store sales that missed estimates in the U.S. Sales increased by just 0.9 percent, while international sales were up 2.6 percent less than analyst estimates. Now, executives did say on the call that less consumers are ordering delivery overall across the industry as they return to pre-COVID behaviors like sitting down inside of restaurants and with higher delivery costs due to inflation, more customers. Customers are opting to cook at home. Now this hurt Domino's with delivery at the core of its business, especially here in the U.S. Here in the U.S., that makes up for about 60 percent of sales. Domino's CEO Russell Wiener called the brand a work in progress mm. as it continues to navigate labor and food inflation. Now, I do also want to note that in 2022 overall, they raised prices by more than 5 percent. Q4 compared to a year ago then, up 6.3 percent. They, of course, want to continue to provide value, but obviously kind of struggling there. It's the consumer is getting completely squeezed, and they really went with this strategy of the sports or strategy of the delivery. I mean, right. they bet the farm on that. Yep, calling it a tech company, a delivery right. company, trying to find their way through this. But of course, they did introduce those loaded tots. They're really weighing big on innovation, big I ideas love here a good when you tot. Them. I love yeah. a good tot, but I don't know <laughs> if I'm trying the Domino's tots. However, they were one of the disruptors in the digital ordering cycle that we had seen really emerge with Domino's too.